Hey guys, Will from Tested. I'm Norm from Tested. We are here in the dark, moist confines of the Whiskey Media Bar. Hold. Today we're gonna give you a quick look at a really cool iOS app I have here on iPad, but it's really an iPhone app called Panky. Okay. P-E-N-K-I. What does Panky do? Uh, Panky is a program that lets you draw holographic images. Like a light photograph. Kind of like a light pen. You know how people use long exposures and they draw stuff? Like yeah, yeah, yeah. Ads? Like with a like flashback that, or something. Okay. But on your iPhone or iPad. So what you can do is you can type in text. Okay. Uh, or you can use uh, symbols. We're just going to do text. Like, test it. Okay. Done. I like that. I can make it bold, which is it is right Change now. Change the color, stuff like Change that. Change the color. Right now it's green. I like I can green. do gradients. I like blue. Uh, let's do a red to Ooh, orange. Sassy. And then the one last thing you need to do is change the settings so it matches your camera settings. We want to have exposure length about 10 seconds. You can have it as four seconds. We found that uh, longer is better. And what happens when you click paint is okay. it'll count down Whoa. for five seconds. Four, Whoa. three, two, I feel like I'm two, starting a race. One. This better be awesome. And then for 10 mm. seconds, it will show mm. this. This is kind of gibberishy. Well, I, I can't read it at all. This, this is not holograms. This is like the computer lights blinking at the end of war games. I don't know, have any idea what's going on here. Obviously, it doesn't work on the iPad. You can't see mm. the hologram on the iPad because you see it in your camera. So mm. let's actually do it okay. with the camera. Okay, so now it's just as easy as like putting the button on the camera and walking over there and doing some stuff, right? Not exactly. What we need to do, and why we have tape and a ruler, okay. is uh, with our settings, we need to measure out 34 centimeters. Okay. What I'm gonna do is move the iPad from start all the way to the end over 10 seconds while the picture is being taken. A little wobbly. All right, so with the iPhone, you can actually create your own little dolly contraption. What we have right now is the iPhone on a, a mini tripod attached to a chair, and I'm gonna roll the chair across the camera. The Z got cut off. Yeah, it's still way too bright. All right, we're gonna try it with no lights on. Uh, having black. too many lights on means we can't see the image that well. Let's try a couple things. Lights off. Yeah. Okay, so this time we've turned on some different room lights, turned off some others, and Norm's also like two or three feet further away from the camera than he was before. We'll see how this one goes. Fuck yes, that is awesome. So that's Panky. That's, that's cool. That's Panky. Very cool. Yeah. 99 cents. It's just a fancy flashlight with some, you know, digitized text. So we learned a few things. One, yes. you need to have the lighting in the room perfect. If the lighting is too dark, no lights, you get nothing. It just looks like text. Okay. If lighting's too bright, then the text gets washed out. Focus on the background or on the iPhone? Here, I have focus on the iPhone, which makes the text look sharp. Okay. Or you can focus on the background, which makes the text look more like a ghost. It's actually kind I of like cool. It, I like it on the background better. Yep. And then the last thing is to shoot toward the darkest part of the dark room. Yeah, you can have a little bit of lighting, but really sh shoot where there's not a glaring light, and, so you don't see the light bulb. I mean, when we shot down here, this was all almost pitch black, so. Yeah, because it's a long exposure. Yeah, the camera picks it up. Yep. So you can do it with the DSLR, point and shoot, still works. Decent camera Decent or a stack tripod, of books or something like that. tripod, stack of books, as long as you can keep the camera steady for about 10 seconds. Panky, very cool. Hope you enjoyed it. We're tested. I'm Will. See ya. Bye.